just, you know, just when I was doing a Harley Quinn news video, you know, and they're playing another bomb to the trough. And it looks like my fear came to also, did you read now for today? Well, kind of, sort of. I got made before doing a Harley Quinn video, it looks like did, did not read for more of the comics. So what the fuck did you mean? I mean, it was about the comic side, ain't it? Hey guys, me on Touch and I'm going to DD Human Service Spring to comment on 2021 uh, DD Imminent. Yep. Now, do we want to talk about the green one? I don't know, no, I'm going to see what you see in Well, at least half the students say, more for the media side and half of the comic side, I kind of mix up both. So, here you see it now, Spring, as you the comic side, finally, it's actually interesting. But also, some more questions in your What's the point of serving anyway if it already is your max stuff? So yeah, it should be fun. Again, what the new minute? Well, you'll find out, Adam. So, do my find anything, anything you? Yep, see ya. Alright, Adam, alright, Adam. As you can tell from my intro, so you can tell what intro about this news. Why? You'll find out. Let's get started. According to an article I have a video from news.com, and I quote, DG News Service swing the, the comment only 2021. Yep, I did you imminent. Yep. The DG News Service will be rebranded in 2021 at DG Human Imminent with a full ex exclusive release on comics. With the TV and film content and the service had accumulated the past two years, becoming exclusive to the recently launched HBO Max streaming service. Yep. Modern like the Ultimate Comics Discovery Service, DG News Imminent will expand DG News Digital Com and Category on including the recently launched Digital First Round Comics. New comics will be a problem called DG News Imminent Originals. Yep. As well as the quicker six month turnaround from a comic with a reason and addition to flat rate of the reading service. It's basically compared to more limited, that's what they say, they would not mind, yep. All comics will already be downloaded for offline reading as well. All fans will love the platform, will be the love of comics. Comics, yep. And with the transformation, we will not disappoint, Jim Lee says, yep. With the National Excited to share that not only do you even know it, still be able to read all the big comics that they've enjoyed, but new issues are just being on the platform quicker than before. Due to the first crew job being cleared and the memory of the only event will begin as soon as possible. Yep. This, this, there's never a better time to be a DC fan. Yep. And it's in, it's expected to launch in January 21st, 2021. With plans for an international world in summer 2021. Yep. Um, you see, it, it, it say we'll have more than 24 band content at launch. On the server, that's not much. One of the current DC units in, in which broke 20 band content on May 12th. And you want to keep DC units coming second alive and make it available even for the general public after description. Yep. Um, after the price, it'll cost $55 a month. Naturally. Yep. Um, the cost of the internet will be the much the same as DC Universe, $8 a month. And those that are subscribed to you and invite by February 1st will see a voucher for the DC shop for 20 whatever and subscribers and turn it off from month to month subscribers. Yep. And nothing all in the show. But it all jokes, the DC even now for you dead, and now this thing is now pretty owned by the comic side only. Means DC is now officially and it'll be dead. Yep, and yeah, they're all in the show. My father, all, as you well know, though, I'm not here for DC Universe Street. Well, the DC Street Street Department had so much pretend to be great, but we were so much show that I think you got in this show. We could have been a super anime show, I've been saying, we were reading a super family show. We could have been a super sense show out there on that show. Like, there's so much better way with the show, you know, that, that they be uh, squandered to the point that actually that did thing now actually off sweet. Now, granted, you know, I get why they did this because we have extra max and Jonathan now, so this makes DC even now off sweet. But here's my question today. What are we doing this same anime and don't hit not get copyrighted and not put them on the comics? Like doing them. I'm happy that the thing is still alive and the thing is not gonna be on the comic side. That's the good thing. But the bad news in general is that I mean all the TV shows, all the shows that the world on that service and people who bought the DJ stream service for the shows are now go up through all the stuff. Like don't know. The comics are made amazing, the comics are fantastic, but People got to you know, on for the well, not just the comic side, but for the media stuff. Because Adam Man 4, well, we got this shirt on for Titan, Swamp Thing, Young Justice, and Harley Quinn. And Stargo. But with all those shows now leaving, this make did make the thing you know, obsolete. Fact. Because with, with all these shows, with Titan acting now going into a match, Jupiter going into a match, and with Stargo now being put on CW, all the other shows acting on into a match or CW, well, Hard Queen Swamp Thing got changed because of bullshit reasons. Hard Queen you now is on Info Max now. Hard young, young Justice. I think that's going to Info Max. We don't know. We don't know about that. Well, I think we do know, but either my points. And all shit I'm going to Info Max now. This makes it even off sweet. And this makes people who got this service you now they can't be ripped off. Now don't go don't, don't get on Jordan. I am happy that all shit are surviving well. Except for Swamp Thing. Swamp Thing got canceled. I didn't remember for bullshit reasons. But. I, <coughs> 
what what the point? What was the point of Silver Dynamite? Because this means the Silver Dynamite could be waste of time. And people bum who bought the Silver Dynamite are not going to be worth off. And I, I, I'm completely honest. I'm happy the thing's still alive. And I'm not having the comic side goes about understanding that the good news. But the bad news, you know, I think that means who people who bought the thing for the shows are now going to be kind of disappointed. Because I mean, you know, this thing is now basically obsolete. But like I said, you know, I honestly, I suspect it had a very big game again. All the potential was thrown out the window to make it to a macro announce. And this thing was going to die anyway. So, it's, I don't know. I'm happy the thing is not going to be like the comics right now. But I'm absolutely kind of disappointed that the thing is now lost the old everything to keep the thing going. Like, it's, it's kind, of, kind of like a split in the middle. I'm sad, angry, but also happy. I, I, I don't know. I know people like this. Now, what do you mean you want to evolve the TV show I'm in for? We don't know. As I said, all the shows are going to for Max, Star Wars, UNCW, Swamp Thing. Do you want to see I don't get why, because I don't know why that show is going to be back to life. The thing that I've been for, so maybe will bring that show back to life. Cool. Yay. We'll probably shoot them. But my opinion is how to bring that show back. But you got a point. My point is, you know, I think I just spent the time from the very beginning, but still, all that potential now, now falling out the window, that just sucked in my opinion. Now, wh what do you mean for the future of the DJ at Hall? Do I mean this thing will survive at the Academy Mall Unlimited? Honestly, I can see that being the case, and I can see people may describe this thing for the comics, but with all the shit on HBO Max, I, who knows how long this, this is going to last at this point. Like, don't get wrong, I haven't, haven't, we all get more, more comments this thing, but I'm, just, I'm obviously disappointed that all that pretending I fall out the window. Which that is stuck in my opinion. But, eh, I'm gonna make a point. Now, what, 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 what do you mean by DC as a whole? What do you mean you know, for the comic side? Well, like I said, um, for what I can tell, you know what I mean for it, all the new comments are gonna come out for DC, right? that's the good news. Uh, and apparently going on a quicker, it's at 6 months turnaround for a comic book original release date, kind of like, uh, Mall Limited. Um, and it will turn out to all, this thing is not going to be falling on the comic side, and all the free comics will be available, even if we're going to do the first exclusive, I didn't understand at the first. So, what do you mean with Deceased? What do you mean at the for Injustice? What do you mean for all the other stuff? We don't know. And, like, 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 like I said, like I said, in general, in general, in general, in general Tonight, like I said, you know, this thing that might have not been, was not gonna last from the very beginning, but I am at least happy people will be able to still like to use the thing for comics, something the news, because the comic industry really needs to survive. That that thing you know will work with like the most, but I am happy this thing is still alive for the comic side. But hey, super percent yeah. So who knows what's gonna happen? But until then, we'll wait, see happens. Now, what what what? What, what would I do in general if I would show up at DC Universe? I would uh, bring back Superman Family Embassy that you appointed years ago, but we don't got. But I said we're not going to get that. What's a good wish, Evans? Now, I have a DC Infinite. What would I subscribe to this thing? Eh, maybe. I don't know. I may subscribe to the curiosity, but my equity didn't have to hide to begin with. And frankly, there really is no point keeping the thing. So. I'll probably stick with HBO Max now, because HBO Max has had, well, they want to maybe not the great show, you don't want to be maybe it's like bad. But, Apple, everything else kind of dishy with now, who knows. Well, like I said, all the shows have gone bye bye, so my best guess in general, the HBO Max will be the future for DC, at least for the movie side. The comic side will stay in DC, so it's kind of a win that's really solution. But, until then, we'll wait to see Anywho, I'll tell about. In conclusion, the MIR DJ student service wins the comic only 21 at DJ in a minute. Um, I'm intrigued, I'm, I'm not excited, I might split down the middle. Probably is happy it didn't survive, but I'm probably disappointed because what makes all the people who vetted DJ right now but they feel like, well, kind of just felt like we, we, we didn't waste time. But at least the things that the comics are some good news at least. It, it's kind of like when, it's kind of a loser situation. Win sets lose, but you make points. I'm make points. But, until then, we'll wait for the Anywho, on top of this, don't wait for our DC streaming service, we're in the comic in 2021. Our DC Infinite, um, pre your um, comic number two, you might do ancient news, do you like it, do it, although, how do you have your DC streaming service, we're in the comic only in 2021. Our DC Infinite, 
um, please don't comment below. I'm um, Oscar Rock on Twitter, follow on Twitter, please don't subscribe my channel, follow on Twitter, please don't the bell icon, yeah, I'll tell you story, play as you can, I'll talk about it longer, good story, Ooh, see ya, bye, this year, hope you know what you're doing, see ya, bye.